हेलो डियर स्टूडेंट्स क्लास सिक्स हिस्ट्री चैप्टर थ्री द फर्स्ट फार्मर्स एंड हर्डर्स बेटा इन आवर सेकेंड हिस्ट्री चैप्टर वी हैव सीन अबाउट द पैलियोलिथिक एज पैलियोलिथिक एज ऑल्सो नोन एज स्टोन एज आफ्टर दैट वी हैव सीन मीसोलिथिक एज मीसोलिथिक एज इज नोन एज मिडल एज नाउ in this we will see about neolithic as well as some further improvement so neolithic age is the topic the mesolithic age or the middle age gave way to the neolithic age about 10000 to 12000 years ago a number of important changes took place during this age the earth became warmer and the ice that covered large part of land started melting so because of heat the ice or the glacier they starts melting now in this age plants and animal life became abundant humans learned to grow their own food and started settling down in one place important inventions like wheel and fired pottery brought further changes in the lives of the people so inventions they changed the human life so the impact of all these changes was so dramatic that this period of human development came to came to be known as neolithic revolution however these changes did not take place overnight it takes long time samay laga is cheez ko changes turant nahi hue they took place over thousands of years they also occurred at different times in different parts of the world let us study some of the important achievements of this age aaiye is chapter mein hum jante hain neolithic age mein kya kya changes hue so first was the che first change was the farming kis agriculture krishi after leading a nomadic existence in search of food for millions of years around 10000 to 12000 years ago human beings began to grow their own food in form of crops agriculture they shifted towards plant or crops cultivation it is possible that they discovered how to grow crops when they saw plants sprouting from seeds the first crop grown were wheat and barley first crop was grown that was wheat and barley later oats rice fruits were also grown second was the domestication of animals and herding pashuon ko paltu banana or herding charana while fossils have shown that some animals especially dogs had begun to be tamed even during the late paleolithic age other animals came to be domesticated from the neolithic age so here the difference between dogs they have tamed during the late paleolithic age but other animals they came to be domesticated from the neolithic age only animals like the cow ox bull donkey goat sheep were tamed and used for plowing the field carrying loads and providing milk food and skin as the number of animals each family owned grew herding developed so as the they started cultivation of crops they also started domesticating animals and they also developed herding simultaneously 
the animals had to be taken care of as a group or herd fed and sheltered jaise pashuon ko wo charane le jate the pashuon ko fir unhone ek sthan pe sambhal ke rakh ek shelter pradan kiya ek chhao pradan ki aur wahi pe unko chara vagairah diya jata tha the herd also had to be moved from place to place in search of fresh fodder fresh fodder ghas chara gah ke liye unko ek sthan se dusre sthan tak bhatakna padta tha jana padta tha now third is the third is a main change that was shelter other people learned to grow food and domesticate animals they began to settle down in larger groups in permanent dwelling ab आदि मानव ने क्या किया कि वो यहाँ वहाँ भटकना छोड़कर एक जगह पे परमानेंटली स्थायी रूप से निवास करने लगे या रहने लगे फॉर दैट फॉर स्टेइंग पर्पज दे मेक शेल्टर एज शोन इन द फिगर एन एलिस्ट्रेशन ऑफ न्योलिथिक पिट डवेलिंग लेफ्ट एंड एन एलिस्ट्रेशन शोइंग इट्स स्ट्रक्चर ऑन आवर राइट हैंड साइड सो रूफ सपोर्ट post is there roof hatch is there smoke hole was there main chamber is there as shown in the figure now next the mostly did so sorry they mostly did so close to river banks why river banks because water will be available easily and other sources of water they built houses out of mud bricks stone रीड्स एंड ब्रांचेस ऑफ ट्रीज आदि मानव ने क्या किया अर्ली हुमन्स ने उन्होंने अपने हाउसेस को शेल्टर को डेवलप करना शुरू किया न्योलिथिक ड्यूरिंग द न्योलिथिक एज द ह्यूमन स्टार्टेड मेकिंग शेल्टर फॉर देम द वॉल्स वेयर ऑफ एन कोटेड विथ प्लास्टर पिट हाउस were a regular feature of the neolithic age pit houses so as you can see this was the regular feature of the neolithic age now next was the the invention of the wheel and the axel as shown in the figure let left hand side one of the earliest specimen of a wheel has been found in ukraine that is shown on our left hand side now the wheel is, the wheel is believed to have been invented at the beginning of the neolithic period aisa mana jata hai ki neolithic nav paashan yug shuru hone ke samay hi wheel pahiye ya chakra ka chakra ki khoj kar li gayi thi early humans would have seen that objects could be removed could be moved more easily if placed on something cylindrical like a log log of wood over time wheels were added on either side of the logs making it possible to move object faster and over longer distance because of its cylindrical shape so this supported neolithic humans to carry load from one place to another place this marked the birth of the wheel with excel excel one of the most important invention of the human history now what is excel excel is the rod placed at the center of a wheel that helps it rotate freely excel kya hai jo pahiyon ke beech mein jisse dono taraf ke pahiye jude hote hain aur pahiyon ko ghumne mein jo मदद करता है दैट इज नोन एज एक्सल द फर्स्ट व्हील्ड कार्ट और कैरियज अपियर्ड अराउंड थ्री थाउजेंड टू हंड्रेड बिफोर क्राइस्ट एरा इन द यूरेशियन ग्रास लैंड एरियाज अराउंड कैसपियन सी सो फर्स्ट व्हील्ड कार्ट वॉज फाउंड इन यूरेशियन ग्रास लैंड ड्यूरिंग थ्री थाउजेंड टू हंड्रेड बी सी the invention of the wheeled cart revolutionized the way people traveled isse kya hua ki logon mein 
एक स्थान से दूसरे स्थान जाने के लिए जो व्हील की जो पहिए लगी गाड़ियाँ थी उनका चलन बढ़ा उनका यूज बढ़ा रिवोल्यूशन हुआ पीपल ऑल्सो बिगेन टू यूज द व्हील टू स्पिन कॉटन एंड मेक यार्न फॉर क्लॉथ और इसी चक्र इसी घुमावदार चक्र का यूज करके हुमेंस ने क्या किया कि कॉटन को थ्रेड फैब्रिक में कन्वर्ट करने के लिए थ्रेड में कन्वर्ट किया और उसी थ्रेड को मिक्स करके क्लॉथ के रूप में यूज किया नो टूल्स एंड टेक्नोलॉजी इन द नियोलिथिक एज पीपल बिगेन टू मेक टूल्स दैट हेल्प देम इन फार्मिंग एंड हर्डिंग दे ऑल्सो मेड डिफरेंट काइंड ऑफ टूल फॉर देयर यूज इन डेली लाइफ दे रीडिजाइन द एक्स बाय पॉलिशिंग एंड ग्राइंडिंग द एज ऑफ टू अ फाइन शार्पनेस सो दे ऑल्सो मेड शार्प इट द शार्प इट वॉज यूज टू क्लियर फॉरेस्ट फॉर कल्टिवेशन सिकल्स वेयर ऑल्सो इन्वेंटेड एंड वेयर यूज टू हार्वेस्ट क्रॉप्स ग्राइंडर्स यूज टू ग्राइंड ग्रेन वेयर मेड बाय प्लेसिंग टू स्टोन वन ऑन टॉप एंड टॉप ऑफ ईच अदर एक दूसरे के ऊपर उन्होंने पत्थरों की सील को रखा जिससे उन्हें अनाज के दाने को पीसने में हेल्प हुई लुक एट द पिक्चर इन द एक्टिविटी एट द बिगिनिंग ऑफ द चैप्टर सो वी हैव सीन दिस फिगर एट स्टार्टिंग ऑफ दिस चैप्टर एंड सम मोर फिगर्स और किचन यूटेंसिल्स आर शोन हियर इन ऑन आवर राइट हैंड साइड यू कैन सी ऑल्सो बेटर न्यूलिथिक पीपल could focus on other activities like pottery and weaving pottery and weaving was they were the main focused areas during this revolutionized neolithic age instead of animal skin or grass basket clay pottery mitti ke bartan began to be used to cook and store food because it lasted longer and could withstand high temperature while cooking clothes made out of cotton and wool began to replace rough animal skins people wore in the paleolithic and mesolithic ages so development in clothes as well as use of cotton in good way it happens in neolithic age now we'll see the social life the social life in neolithic period human being started living in groups samuh mein rehne lagna ek sath miljul ke rehna over time the groups grew into tribes janjatiyon mein aage chal ke bate a tribe is a group of people who are related and share common custom and tradition what is tribe ट्राइब एक समूह है लोगों का या समूह हुआ करता था लोगों का जिसमें वो किसी खास धर्म को विशेष धर्म को और अपने बिलीफ को ट्रेडिशन को कल्चर को मानते थे मोस्ट ट्राइब्स हैड अ रिकग्नाइज लीडर और इनका एक लीडर सरदार हुआ करता था Neolithic society consists consisted of several such tribes conflict between these tribes for the land and resources was common jab people group was divided when the people group was divided into different tribes they started fighting with each other for land as well as for other resources like water etc they fought among themselves so that was social life now we'll see elsewhere in eastern asia this is a just a topic or an article small article in eastern asia in the southern eastern part of turkey lies the neolithic site of gobi clay 
tepe gobikale tepe this is believed to be one of the oldest human made places of worship discovered till now it consists of as shown in figure beta it consists of more than 200 massive t shaped stone pillars arranged in circles each pillar is around 6 meter tall and weigh up to 20 tons 3 meter uncha aur 20 ton wazan wala ye pillar tha each of the pillar has exquisitely carved figures of animals it is a mystery how the early humans cut these stones with such precision or how they transported these massive stones from the quarry so this was the place as shown in the figure now we'll see na another development during neolithic age was economy and trade arthavyavastha aur vyapar in the beginning early humans made everything they needed on their own they grew their own food made their own tools and weapons and wore their own clothes neolithic humans they have made food tools and clothes for themselves with time however with time as the time passes over the period of time division of labor took place samay ke sath logo mein kya hua ki apne apne karyon ko apne apne occupation ko vyavsay ko baant liya this meant that task came to be divided amongst families and individuals according to their particular skills apni apni yogyata shamta aur kala ki hast kala ke anusar apne kaam ko baant liya farmers grew grains potters made pots and weavers wore the clothes they exchanged their extra produce with things made by others wo ek dusre se share karte the tab us samay pe paise nahi the paise ka chalan nahi tha so barter system was there this earliest form of trade where goods were exchanged for other goods and not money is known as barter b a r t e r barter system now the religion the neolithic people worshiped forces of nature many neolithic groups also worshiped mother goddess matra devi matra devi ki puja karte the as can be seen from the large number of figurine figurines of mother goddesses found at neolithic sites they also believed in an after life burial sites found at many neolithic sites indicate that the dead body were buried with many objects that people believed may be needed in the after life jahan pe logon ko dafnaya jata tha wo smashan bhumi meli aur unke sath mein jo dead bodies thi dead bodies ke sath mein aur bhi dusri vastuve mili jo unke daily life mein use hua karti thi ya after life mein mana jata tha ki use ho sakti hai now one case study is there we will see this in next lecture so up till today we will stop here up to religion in our next video we will start with case study till then thank you students